The All Meghalaya SSA School Teachers Association threatened the state government that if it pays no heed to the demands of the Sakmagra Shiksha Abhiyan teachers within the 30th of November, they will file a legal suit in the High Court of Meghalaya to get the rights and dues. Speaking to media persons, the president of MSSASTA, Sri Aristotle Rambai, said that the state government has violated the rules and regulations of the RTE Act 2009 and in the agriculture agitation held recently. They had given the government two weeks time to act upon the demands which will end on the 30th of November and if they do not get a satisfying response from the state government by then, they will make a move at the Meghalaya High Court. At the same time, the MSSASTA teachers have also strongly condemned the statement of the Chief Minister of Meghalaya, Konrad Sangma, which claims that there is no such rule or regulations which direct the state government to regularize the post of the SSA teachers. The Association of SSA Teachers has taken the decision to strongly protest against the statement of the Chief Minister of Meghalaya as it is unacceptable and also demands that the Chief Minister must certify his statement with proper documents. With regards to salaries of the SSA teachers, Rimbai said that after the implementation of the new SSA schemes, as per rules and regulations stated clearly, the central government will fund 15000 per month for each lower primary teacher and 20000 per month for each upper primary teacher and the rest is to be funded by the budget of the state government. He expressed his surprise over the state government not releasing the amount of 104 crores to the state implementation society and has also raised a question over the reason behind the state government not releasing this amount to the office of the state project director. Further, he also said that the government has received the first installment of 59 crores for the payment of five months spending salaries of the SSA teachers. And and if this is to be totaled with the amount of 104 crores already mentioned, this should be enough to pay the salaries of the 12,541 SSA teachers in the state.